Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamu alaikum everyone. Today we are going to conduct lecture number 40 of this course. And today's topic is transmission register and DSR register. So TXREG is basically transmitter register. So let's start our lecture. Okay. What is transmitter register? TXREG is a specific register which is dedicated for uh, dedicated in SFR portion of file register for PKDNF microcontroller and TXREG stands for transmitter register. As its name suggests, whatever the data we want to transmit, we will use this register because this will be serving as a transmitter purpose, right? So let's say if I want to transmit the value 24 uh, serially, so what I will do, I will put that value inside this register. And how can I put it? For example, uh, I want to transmit move little to working two for hacks, right? So I will actually move it into working register, which is a very important and integral register. And then we will move working register into transmit register, move working file, transmit register, right? Here one can ask, uh, so what is going to happen that uh, this two for will be, which was the content of earlier uh, working register, it will move into transmit register. And then uh, transmit register is an eight bit register. Uh, so it will transmit uh, from the lower significant side, right? For example, uh, two four hacks could be written as at bit zero zero one one zero and zero one double zero. So uh, transmission will start from this least significant bit side, right? This bit will be transmitted first, then this, and then this, and then this. So we know that uh, it is going to be transmitted serially. So it will not transmit from eight pins simultaneously rather it will be transmitted from one single pin and that pin is dedicated in port c right so that pin is basically a transmit pin so we will be using transmit pin right tx pin tx pin is known as uh, transmitted pin right uh, so they serve as transmit pin and this is the portion of uh, port c right or it is present in port c so we know that if we want to transmit uh any 8 bit value we have to place it in transmit register and then automatically that value will be transmitted using tx pin which is present in uh, port c right uh, here we come to another important register which is kind of related with transmission transmit register or transmitter register that register is known as uh, tsr or transmit shift register transmit shift register uh, what is going to happen uh, once you have transmitted the value or you have placed the value which you want to transmit inside uh, or which you want to transmit serially. Uh, for example, we wanted to transmit two, four hacks we placed in working register and then uh, the value of working register was placed inside transmit register. So what is going to happen uh, that value in transmit register with automatically, right? It is a backhand process. Uh, user will not involve or programmer will not involve in these procedures, but what is going to happen? The value of transmit shift register automatically on backhand will transmit to uh, TSR register. And what is TSR? Tra TSR register is transmit shift register. It automatically, it, it actually uh, perform two functions for us. Number one is called framing. And what is framing? I have already explained you uh, framing concept uh, when I was explaining what is asynchronous transmission. Remember, we have been uh, considering asynchronous serial port communication. So in asynchronous uh, communication, uh, uh, information is not directly transmitted. Rather, they are uh, framed or they are uh, combined with start and stop bits, right? So that start and stop bits are provided in procedure called framing and that uh, framing is done by what register transmit shift register so that means a two four hacks was the information which we wanted to transmit we placed in working register what is going to sorry we placed it in transmit shift register with the help of working register and then that with that uh, transmit shift register uh, will automatically transmit the, that value into transmit shift register and transmit shift register First of all, it will perform framing and then it will transmit that information serially. So you know that transmit shift register is going to add start and stop bit. So earlier it was eight bit information, but uh, once it is going to be framed, so what is going to happen? This eight bit information 
will be converted into 10 bit information right and those bits will be transmitted uh, serially from tx pin which i have already explained you earlier that this specific pin will be used for transmission purpose which is the part of port c and again it will be happening automatically you won't need it to uh, use any kind of programming so uh, another function of uh, transmission register is first function is framing which means we are going to add start and stop bit uh, stop bits in the into the original information and the next function of tsr is uh, transmission of uh, transmission of information right serially right via tx pin so these are the two important function uh, which are performed by tsr register and uh, I will uh, again repeat myself that it is going to happen automatically. Programmer won't be uh, involved in these procedures, right? Okay, that's it from this video tutorial. If you have any confusion or comments, you can post in your comment section. Thank you so much for listening.